We are in a play in need of a profound cleansing gesture. Spiritual, physical, emotional, intellectual, real. This house needs a cleaning. This house needs a cleaning. This city needs a cleansing. This building needs a cleansing. This country needs a cleansing. Politics need a cleansing. Democracy need a cleansing. Justice need to become cleaner. Art allows us to access something that we don't know we needed to see. An opportunity to see the world in sort of its biggest way. Processional performance, being a staple of my performative practice since the very beginning. It's about grabbing, capturing energies and communication that is only happening in the flesh, in the moment, in these classic spaces of the National Gallery. It exists someplace between theater and improvisation. It's about the audience and the space and the sound and you responding to all your fellow collaborators. So that's where some of the magic starts to happen. Ancestors, in this day, give us permission to mark this particular building, this particular site. Magda is the descendant of enslaved Afro-Cubans who worked the sugar fields in the largest sugar plantation area in Cuba. She knew her grandfather who was enslaved. All of us are calling to our ancestors and trying to have a moment in which we are co communing with this building. Magdalena has found certain uh, calls which we are all reacting to. She says, Chego Kefa. And we repeat that a few times, but then afterwards we say, Chego. So we're calling to who has arrived. Our ancestors have arrived. Esther Vina. Amparo, Fautina, Telefora. Our family history was traced back to Africa when they were brought over to the United States as slaves. And when she said, you know, name your ancestors, I just started calling out some of them. And it really, it really touched, touched me very personally. We gather for love. We gather for hope. We gather for peace. We are still in the middle of a pandemic. We are in the middle of decay, death, despair, and hope. Huge amount of hope. This is what I am here, performing, believing that this terrible moment that we are, we are maybe about to come out of it. for industrious ladies. Make way, fighters, grand matriarchs, imagining necessary glory in the whistling air. The songs call us back. This house needs a cleansing. This house needs a cleaning. This house needs a cleaning. It reminded me of my mother you know, and on Sundays when we all get together and we clean the entire house and how they connected this idea of cleaning to like cleansing our society and our culture of some of our ailments. I think as women and as marginalized communities, 
We are always aware of when a space was not built for us. It announces to a space that we're here and we're here to stay. As an artist and as a woman, we are so often, we feel alone and we feel isolated. And there's something so beautiful about all of these like diverse and powerful women coming together and communing. When we gather, when women come together and negotiate their difference, negotiate their individualities for a common good. That doesn't mean that there's no disagreements, disappointments, moment of clash, but always the possibility to come together for a better, more larger than self possibility and proposition of goodness. I think that that is in the center of when we gather. <laughs>